My dear students at Cortage International Schools, especially primary six, welcome back again. Today we're going to resume discussing the reflexive pronouns الضمائر الانعكاسية. So please, I want you to open these pages. Pupil book 97, workbook 85, and the booklet 19 and 20. Get ready and follow with me, please. Now, we can revise the two kinds of reflexive pronouns. We have the singular and the plural pronouns. Myself, yourself, himself, herself, and itself are the singular reflexive pronouns. The plural reflexive pronouns are ourselves, yourselves, themselves. I hope that you studied that already, okay? Now, go to your booklets, page 19, and follow with me, okay? The reflexive pronouns, الضمائر الانعكاسية. These pronouns are combinations of two words. عبارة عن مزيج من كلمتين. A pronoun, ضمير, plus self, للمفرد, selves, للجمع. We have self, مفرد, selves, للجمع. طبعا الضمار الانعكاسية تعتبر مفعول به لأن الفاعل والمفعول به هو نفس الشخص وتستخدم للتأكيد أو عندما يعود أثر هذا الفعل على الفاعل نفسه. مثلا لأقول أنني أعددت فنجان القهوة بنفسي I write I made it myself. Object pronouns ضمائر تبدأ بالمفعول به himself, herself, itself, themselves لاحظوا هنا أن الضمائر هاي اللي بدأنا فيها هي ضمائر object ضمائر المفعول به okay? The boy hurt himself Mom can sue by herself The cat can clean itself Babies can't walk by themselves المجموعة الأخرى تستخدم the possessive adjectives my, our, your هدول هم so we have للمتكلم المفرد I could print this email by myself متكلم الجمع ourselves طبعا we can take care of ourselves Yourself, للمخاطب المفرد. Do your homework by yourself, Sally. I'm talking to Sally here, okay? Yourselves, tidy your room by yourselves, children. I'm talking to the children, plural. Now, let's do exercise number one. I've already written the answers. Write the best reflexive pronoun. Itself, themselves, himself. Number one. Can the car move itself? Because we have here the subject is, sorry, the subject is car. The subject is car. Okay. Number two. Adam can cook by himself. The subject is Adam. Number three. My children sometimes help themselves in their homework. The subject is children. Okay. Exercise number two. Write sentences using these suggested pronouns. From your own creation. If you have written other examples, it's okay. But you have to be careful with the subject and the reflexive pronoun. Okay. I've already written some examples. Myself, I can do this some by myself. Himself, Suhaib won the competition. He is proud of himself. These are su suggested examples, okay? You can write whatever you want. Okay, now let's get back to pupil book, page 97. Look and correct the mistakes. We have mistakes. So we have to correct them. 
The mistakes aren't in the reflexive pronouns already, okay? The mistakes in the sentence. Number one, the old lady looked at herself in the mirror. The wrong answer is the girl. So, the wrong word is the old lady. Phrase, of course. Old lady. Write the girl instead of the old lady. Number two. The scissors are sharp. Be careful. Don't cut yourself. This picture isn't scissors. Isn't for scissors. It's a knife. So we write the knife is a skin. Number three. Enjoy yourselves at the sports club girls, said mom. They aren't girls, they're boys. So the wrong word is girls. Number three, four, sorry. The dog sat in the sun and washed itself. Is it a dog? Of course not, it's a cat. Dog. We enjoyed ourselves on the swings, said Molly. They are playing on a slide, not swings. Number six. I bought myself a lollipop, said Freddy. It's an ice cream, not a lollipop. Lollipop is Number seven. They passed their exam. They were angry with themselves. They were very, very pleased. They were very pleased. كانوا مسرورين, مبسوطين. They weren't angry. ما كانوا غضبين من نفسهم أو زعلانين من حالهم. They were very pleased. مسرورين. The boy sat down and hurt himself. He fell down. سقط. Not sat down. So the wrong word is sat. Check your answers, please. Now, let's go to the workbook exercises, page 85. Exercise number one. Complete the sentences with the words in the box. Myself, yourself, himself, herself, itself. Singular. Okay, if you have noticed, they're all singular reflexive pronouns. Number one. I hope you enjoy yourself. Yourself. The subject here is you. Number two. The monkey is looking at itself in the mirror. The monkey. al -qurd. I fell over on the icy road and hurt myself. The subject is I. The boy bought himself an electric guitar. The subject is the boy. Aunt Jane cut herself on a piece of glass. Aunt Jane is the subject. Number two. Complete the sentences with the words in the box. Now we have the plural reflexive pronouns, okay? Ourselves, yourselves, themselves. You've done very well, said the teacher. Give yourselves a clap. يعني كان شغلكم كتير كويس. So give yourself, yourselves a clap. حيو أنفسكم. We passed our exams. We were very pleased with ourselves. Ourselves. Look. We have a mistake here, okay? We will write it again, okay? So we have ourselves. Okay. The next one. Okay. The children opened their eyes and found themselves in a dark forest. الأطفال فتحوا أعينهم وجدوا حالهم في غابة مظلمة. Okay, now number three. We have a picture. 
and we have to write a sentence explaining this picture using, of course, the reflexive pronouns. The cat is cleaning itself. القطة تنظف نفسها. نوصفها الآن. So we have to use the present continuous. نستخدم المضارع المستمر لأنه نوصف ماذا يحدث الآن in each picture في كل صورة. Number two. The girl is looking at herself in the mirror. Number three. They are enjoying themselves on the swings. Number four, he hurt himself with the hammer. Ada nafso bi al mutraka. Of course, number four is up to you. You have to answer about yourself, okay? Answer these questions. When were you last angry with yourself? Meta kunt ghadban o zalan bin halak akhir marra. So you have to answer. From your own life, okay? When did you and your friends last enjoy yourselves? Yourselves, okay? Try to answer them, please. This is, was the end of our lesson for today. Tomorrow, inshallah, we're going to discuss a new rule. It's like revision, of course. The simple past and the past continuous with when and while. So, tomorrow we'll meet again. Bi amanillah.